from Las Vegas, Nevada. An increasingly confident Kenny Norton, feeling he can't be hurt by Jimmy Young, executing his battle plan exactly as he perceived it. Ripping Young with rights, principally to the midsection. A left there, another left there, and then up with the left. And another long left to the midsection. It's hard to measure how Young feels under the impact of the punishment he has taken to the stomach in this fight. But the accumulative impact has to be, it seems to us, great. In the meantime, Norton, with that head tucked in against the chest, Fighting from a crouch is effectively preventing Jimmy Young from using his counter-punching style. There's Norton up to the head. Young with the right leg. Then left. Get at Norton's head. Kenny has his head tucked into Norton's chest. But right by Young, right there. Norton felt that. But left by Kenny. Young is going to have to, since we're up to the ninth round, fight more aggressive. Young registers dismay with Carlos Padilla, the official, who warned him not to hold on to Norton. With the arm around the head. Thought missing with the left. Young. Trying to be more aggressive in this round. Both fighters taking a breather in effect with their clinch. They're both beginning to feel a bit tired now. Good right lead by Norton. And the left got up to Young's nose. And Kenny goes back to working on the belt. Not missing with the right, scoring, but only mildly with the left. Rather young. Young with a good right. Counting down to the end of round nine. Good left in there, and another by Norton. Now he's getting that left through the head, and he goes right back to the midsection with that right. Kenny fighting a very intelligent fight and making it work. <laughs> Round 10 underway. It's 11.30 in the east. Over most of those eastern stations, your local news will probably be coming up at the end of this fight. And it's been, as I said, an absorbing fight tactically. Kenny Norton, after three disappointing for him rounds, in the very beginning, making his battle plan work to a nicer, leveling. Jimmy Young with a, an attack to the midsection and gradually beginning to get to Jimmy Young's head. But really, mauling Young with body punishment. At least that's the way we subjectively see this fight. Young right there with a good right lead and then the left. And Norton was hurt. Again, Norton keeping that left low. And Young got in three rights, a couple of lefts, and Norton was hurt. There's another right. Jimmy Young the aggressor now. And Norton feeling the impact. Watch Young. This is where his astuteness as a boxer comes into play. Not to leave himself open. Not to get reckless. But to pick the opponent apart if he can. Norton fighting back. Going right back to that midsection with his own right. But suddenly, Jimmy Young becomes the man scoring in this round. It is the tenth round. Again, Young with the right lead over Norton's left. Jimmy missing with the right. Padilla, third man in the ring, breaks the fighters. Young with a couple of left jabs that don't get through. Norton picks them off with his right. He's got his right up in front of his face, or at least his face tucked over that right. You see him cover. Crowd reacted to that, but they were mistaken. Tenth round 
action. Right there, Kenny with another right to the midsection. But in this round, with 45 seconds left, Young suddenly comes to life, completely dominant, hurting Norton with the right. Norton falling with the left. Young's eyes look a little red, a little glazed. But he certainly has fought a purposeful round here. Trying to keep Kenny off. Padilla keeps looking at Young's eyes very closely. We're going to follow Young back to his corner as the ring. All right. Now watch Young. There's the right to cut to Kenny, then a left. Kenny felt that right. He was stung by it. And another right. And you saw the legs buckle just a touch. And so Young assumed command of that ramp ramp. There's Kenny quickly becoming aggressive. judges, not by the referee. Of the 11th round. 